Hi everybody. It is seven o'clock on the button. I am gonna wait a couple of minutes to, for people to get logged in. Hope you guys are doing good. And I gotta make sure that my other side is quiet, but I definitely want to um, share this over to the creative group so everybody over in the group can see it. If you're not a member of my creative group, just send me a request on Facebook private messenger after the live is over. If you send it right now, it'll just jam me up and I won't be able to talk. <laughs> uh, let's see, creating. And will the problem continue? I haven't been able to share anything uh, over while I've been live for a couple of days. Hey, Diane, how you doing? Oh, gosh, I wish you were here because when Diane is here and we get to do the banter thing, it's way funnier. <laughs> so I'm just going to have to pretend you're in the room, Di. Um, that's okay. I'm going to go on and share it a different way. So just give me one second and then I'll... Um, because I want to make sure that everybody in my club can see this and everybody in my creative group. Because if you have a current catalog and you got the big, long retirement list, holy smokes, it's like pages and pages and pages long. It's kind of a drag to go through it by yourself. So, I thought that we'd do it together. Tomorrow, I um, have my monthly class up in Litchfield. I have a private class that I run there every month. And um, thank you, Diane. She's here in spirit. Um, and I will go through tonight and mark up eight catalogs so that when my friends come to class and they want to um, kind of be pointed to the area where all the retiring stuff is, they don't have to look at this because honestly, I can't even... I can barely see it. I put mascara on. Um, it it happens. What can I say? So I'm gonna go over and just share this to the few groups to make sure that um, my customers can see it. And then, oh, it says live video explicit. I didn't think it was explicit. Um, I'm moving up in the world. Um, <laughs> that's funny. Okay. Stanford's with Heart. This is going to go on my team page. And then one in my secret group for club. Yeah, the link at the bottom says live underscore video underscore explicit. Wow. That's almost getting like a thumbs down. Yes, I've started. Let's see. Somebody just sent me a private message. Yes, I've started. Silly goose. Um, club. So now that we've got them shared in all of those groups, hopefully everybody can find us so that we can do this together. Live video explicit. All right, so tell me where you're joining us from tonight. Um, are you at home? Where do you live? Oh, I see Betty. I know Betty is California. Tell me where you are. Oh, Conklin, Michigan. Hi, Carol. Good to see you. Mwah. Um, Well, I do not explain things in detail. Explicit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway, um, where are you all joining me from? Let's, uh, let's see where you are. Ooh, South Carolina. Paula, how you doing, Paula? I have a cup of tea here, and I want to tell you a little bit about my tea. I have a tea addiction lately because I found this strawberry stuff. Oh my gosh, it's delicious. And I'll just tell you before you ask, because I know people are gonna ask, I it, this is backwards, I think. It's Fusion Teas, and it's Strawberry Fields. Hey, I got Maine and Susan Mason, and, oh, and one tuck of a stamper, Andrea Tucker. Um, and then the teapot itself has this little gully thing so all of the loose leaf tea sits in this little gully and then it doesn't end up, you know how like if you use a, a tea ball thing, it opens up and it ends up in your drink. Isn't that nasty? So, um, oh, we have down under Melbourne, Australia, Karen from Drake It, 
Ella from Drake It. Hi, Sharon, you found us. I'm so glad you found us. Doris, hey, nice to see everybody. Hey, now it's a stampin' party. I'm so excited you guys are all here, and you and now you know all about my tea. So um, the, the teapot is called For Life, and I got it online. I think it was Amazon. I think it was like 20 bucks. But I, it makes it so nice because then I don't end up with having to clean the little tea ball thing out. I've got this little... Um, this little bucket and I just dump it in the trash. Ooh. I'm spilling it now. Um, I got this little bucket and I dump it in the trash and then I, I can go. And what I like to do is I fill um, this with water and then I pour the tea in my cup and I might add just a little bit of honey. <laughs> no tea balls. <laughs> I love you, Andrea. Oh my God. Yeah, that's why we have explicit content. Um, and then uh, I refill it so I get two goes out of the one thing of tea because um, I'm cheap. So frugal. I'm frugal. Anyway, that's really funny. Oh, my goodness. So shall we jump in? Um, I have two catalogs here. Now, the first one I haven't touched, so we'll do this one together. And then when we get to this catalog... I have it all completely marked so we can just go through. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip the camera. Um, while I do that, can you tell me what you're drinking? Are you drinking tea? Are you drinking coffee? I like coffee. Are you drinking wine or are you drinking something special? So you tell me that and I'm going to just flip the camera. Give me one second. get to see my hand instead of getting dizzy from me moving around the table too much. Alrighty, now I'm going to move the table and hopefully not spill my tea. You can tell which set I'm going to miss completely already. Is that not sad as anything? <sighs> oh, water. Yeah, I can't drink water. It doesn't, it doesn't sit well with me. Ice water. Look at you guys. Hydration is very important. So, I've got my specs. I, I don't wear glasses, but I really should because the writing on this is tiny. So, just so that you know how this works is I've taken this the retiring list and I've pared it down a little bit. I went through line by line and tried to delete everything that was in a foreign language. In addition, um, I took out all the bundles because every bundle technically retires because it's getting re, um, they, they break it apart in the main catalog if it carries over. So um, with that, we're going to go through and mark all of the things in here. Now this one isn't that confusing because um, I just want to make sure that you can see my Please shout if you can see me because I am frozen on my computer screen, so hopefully you can see me okay. Um, but I'm going to flip over to five, and the All My Love Ribbon Combo Pack is on there, and the Designer Series Paper is on there, and the Cardstock Pack is on there. Um, and then we flip over to page eight. So this, again, it's a bundle. So this will be available in the catalog, but it's not going to be available um, in bundle pricing with the 10% off. So I still mark it as a retiring item. Guess what's in the new catalog? We got heart drop epoxy droplets. I like these because you can color them with your blends. And I do. I am going to miss this ribbon. I love the lovely lipstick color. Okay, so moving right along. We, we can skip right over this page, but again... There's a bundle, so we can't get it in the specialty pricing anymore. And on page eight, we have the Hey Love Cling Stamp Set that's going. And on nine, Climbing Roses, and then the whole bundle's gone. <sighs> have no fear. I've already seen the new catalog, so it's not as bad as it seems. But, um... This whole, this whole page, I think, is gone. It's, um, this is so pretty. This was one of my favorite um, designer series papers, and I'm 
really passionate about scrapbooking. So I'm pretty psyched that um, we had this because I got four or five packages of this cardstock. Um, these are staying. This is going, 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 I think. I gotta double check. Double check before you write all over it, Celine. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, nope, I was wrong. Ha, see, psych. Okay. Lime seltzer sounds good, Susan. Raspberry lime seltzer. It sounds like a raspberry lime ricky. I love lime rickies. Um, let's see. 12, to have and to hold cling stamp set is gone. This is cute. I like this image um, of the couple looking away, but I always thought it looked kind of funny because I want to um, see them like looking into the distance. So I thought like if it had like the water and a background and the night sky, then they wouldn't be looking into like nothing. But uh, let's see, 13. Oh, this all made it. So um, again, you'll be able to get this stuff but the, the bundle is gonna retire, so the, the framelits will be separate from the stamp set even though they're intended to be used together. All right, and then on page 15, we have tags. I wish somebody was here to read this for me because it's so tiny. Sweet cups, uh, designer series paper, coastal cabana, all of that's going. I, I didn't see the stamp set. Let me just see. Oh, yep. This is gone too. This is such a cute set. And I loved that you could cut the designer series paper with the framelits. Um, they were already designed and matched up that way. Raspberry lemonade. Yum. I'm still reading your comments. Oh, I got 31 more comments since I read. Let's see. New, New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc. Hmm. Liz, that sounds fabulous. All right, I'm on to 16 now and I'm distracted. 16 is safe, yay! 17, I love this stamp set. My downline, Michelle, made me fall in love with it. I think she used it more than anybody I saw. 604, uh, page 17. Birthday cheer is on there and all the bundles because they only can bundle the first time we offer them. Okay, so then page 19, birthday statements cling. Detailed birthday edgelets. Did I miss something? Nope, I'm good. All right. This is like tiny, tiny writing. I need to get my specs on. Made to bloom. Maybe I should borrow Brian's glasses for this. Okay. And 21. Incredible Like You project kit. Stamp set. This was one of my favorite kits in the book. It was so happy and pretty. And, and the watercolor was all done for you. And then you could lay the the die cut paper right on top. It was like a stamp and stick kind of thing. I like stuff that's easy. If it has more than three steps, I won't do it. So then I can skip to page 25, which is pretty happy. Um, happiness Blooms Designer Series Paper, Stamp Set Punch Pack, Cardstock Pack. I think these are staying. Let's go again, 25. Ribbon. Yeah, the dots are coming back. So that's good to know. The itty bitty punch pack is gonna go too. This is adorable. It has all sorts of little flowers in it. And then there's a there's a, an image that looks like this, which kind of looks like a person to me. But you could use it to like tie up a ribbon or whatever. Um, and then dot to dot, I wanna see if that's on there. Yep. So the dot to dot and embossing fold is gonna go. So the only thing on this page that's staying is the enamel dots. Hopefully, I'm, I'm not seeing your comments right this second, so hopefully if you're commenting, it's gonna pop up soon. Diane, go ahead and say something so I know that um, 
I haven't complete, completely lost everybody. 26, happiness, blooms, memories, and more. Card pack, envelopes. All of these are going. These are pretty, and they're easy to layer up with these memories and more um, card kits, but they're also meant for scrapbooking, and I used the... I used these like crazy this year um, in my books. 27 is safe. So these are going to be in the new catalog. And this one's kind of expensive. This is on my hit list. I love these words. In fact, you might see this for a class from me in May. The, it, the stamp set itself has 51 cling stamps. And it's expensive at $45. And the dies are 40 so together they'd cost you like $85, but because you'd buy them together, you'd get 10% off at 76. So the bundle's gonna retire, but the individual items are carrying over. I absolutely love them. Or if you wanted to break them up, you could buy you know, the dies one month at a class and then get the stamp set another month. That's another way to kind of build your stash slow over time, but I'm, I'm kind of a glutton for a sale, so I like when they're on sale. Um, Amazing Life Photopolymer stamp set is retiring, but it didn't mention anything about the rectangle dies, which I'm pretty happy about. Um, the Flowering Desert is gone. I don't think I ever got that one. Cute, but I didn't. This one's staying, I know, because I did a class. I'm actually doing a class tomorrow with it, and it stayed. His Grace is going out. I love this set. I, um... And making a, a project with it next week. Let's see. My nephew is making his confirmation and I am standing up for him. So I had to move my club. And you know it's important if I move my club because I never do. I never cancel that. Cute crook punch box. This is adorable. Lots of um, images for children's cards, which I thought was good. Can never have enough of those. 32. Okay, then I can skip to 35 because the puppy made it. I love that. But again, the bundle goes away and the stamp set in the new catalog. Live video is interrupted. It should resume shortly. I hope that you guys are seeing me. Oh my goodness. <sighs> All right, on to page 37, Beach Happy is going. This was one of my favorite sets of the season because we do the retreats in Kenny Bunk. And I did this card with it. It was, um, I stamped right on the, uh, oh, I, I skipped page 35. Okay, I'll go back. I stamped right on the designer paper um, and then just stamped again. So you stamp the outline and then you stamp the inside afterwards. And I just stamped tone on tone. So I thought that was pretty cool. Let me go back to 35. Sorry about that. Um, so a recap, Gingham Gala, six by six is gone. The cardstock is gone. The bundle is gone, but they'll still be available separately. I hope that's helpful. I'm trying to get back on trying to get you guys back on my computer um, with not much luck here. Oh well. All right. Well, the computer, I'm just gonna have to suck it up, buttercup. Let's see. Okay, so page 36. Humming along cling mount stamp set is gone. This is great for people who like to color. Um, good, I've got you. So we're all there. Sorry, I touched the camera and then now we're moving. So we, we all know that's going. Needlepoint Nook. Let's see what's going on with that. Page 39. So the mini buttons are gone. Oh my God, there's a whole nother page. <laughs> I'm so glad that I'm doing this with you guys. Um, oh, that's the wrong page. Okay, so it's not a whole nother page. Yay, it's just a few more things. Shoo! Okay, Old Olive Linen Thread, Needlepoint Designer Series Paper, um, the Cardstock Pack, of course the bundle, um, and the stamp set. So this whole thing, this whole page is gone. That's okay, because we're gonna make room for it in the new book, and there's gonna be 
awesome things there. So page 40, Florentine filigree, this whole thing is gone with the die. This is really pretty to make cards for church. Um, you cut out the card, and even if you didn't stamp, you could use the Stamparatus to do it with the hinge stamping technique, but even if you didn't, it's so pretty on its own just as a background. I love it. Let's see, page 41, Flowing Fountain is being retired. I feel like we're, we're uh, retiring a lot. That means that there'll be a lot of new stuff coming. We've got the uh, metallic ribbon. I love this. It, I made racing stripes on my cards or like down the side of um, the car, that thing. This guy is staying, the Garage Elements. 43. Let's see, sorry. Six by six is gone, this is gone, this is gone because it's a bundle. But the stamp set stays, yay. Okay, page 44 is all set, 45 is all set. So we can flip all the way to 47. Um, 46 made it, I love this stamp set. Let's see. 47, the doily is going. I'm so disappointed. I have a thing for doilies. <laughs> and it's probably not what you think. <laughs> Beautifully detailed laser paper is gone. Strong and beautiful is staying. This is a little stressful. It's kind of like leading prayer. You know, like one time I was leading prayer, um, my mom wanted me to lead the rosary. And instead of saying, um, fruit of thy womb, I said, fruit of the loom. You know I did. So I said, I'm not ever leading prayer again unless I can um, read it from a script because I get too tripped up too easy. Family and friends and perfectly paired, both of these are going to go. That's a true story, by the way. We were praying for my... Um, my cousin Deb, who uh, who was going through breast cancer. I can't believe this one's going. Now, this one makes me sad. Everybody needs baby hands. If you don't have baby hands or baby feet in your stamping collection, you need to get this one. These, I, I'll probably... So, I keep religious sets and I keep uh, baby sets because there's always a baby shower or a religious event or... Um, baby shower, wedding shower, those are the types of um, things that you probably won't find in my BOGO come later on. Okay, so 54 and 55, these are the host sets that are available, and both of them are going. Phew! Okay, so that's the, the last bit of reading that I actually have to do because I've already marked a master copy of this one. So I'm just gonna take a sip of tea because I really need it at this point. Yay. And I'm gonna stand up to see if I can see any comments. Hopefully you're all still there. Yay. Okay. So you got your big books, are you guys ready for me? I love this page. Ah, oh, this page, I don't know what it is about the colors in the book that makes me so happy, but I'm back to my happy place right now. Woosa. Okay, so let's start with page seven. The refill on the Notes of Kindness card kit is going out, but this, the main kit with the stamp set will still be available. So you, you'll be able to buy the full kit, but you won't be able to get the refills anymore. This might be something that I stuck up on for um, retreat because I like to put the stamps out on the table and have easy classes that people can take. Soft Sayings card kit is going out completely. Um, if you want to take a look, I have a baggy book right here with this one. Um, these are just cards with overlay. It's so much prettier in person. And um, they're back to back here. Happy in my life. 
And congratulations. This kit is two of each, I believe, of ten designs. So pretty. It's so easy that I can just like... And this gives you a second to catch up if you got behind me at all. Oh, I love this one. It's like a glitter overlay made out of paper. No die cutting, no nothing, all done for you. Hey, Pam, good to see you, friend. I think you're wonderful. <laughs> Perfect timing on that one. Just a note, so this is that um, soft sayings and both of them are retiring. Okay, so the, um, the next one is the Lots of Happy, and again, just the refill is retiring. So you can still get um, the main kit that comes with the stamp set, but just not the refill. The Big Plans Planner Kit, both of them are retiring. Maybe we'll get a new one, knock on wood. Um, and the Calligraphy Essentials page is all retired completely. So on that um, catalog, the retirement list page I had some things that were marked in gray and they were they're actually going to carry over in a different material and I'll explain that in a second um I missed that those are definitely going out you know what I did it at the end so I didn't focus on any of these until the end of the book so um this whole set is going out the tea one but the copper tea tins are staying I can tell you that And page 16, this one's retiring. So this is one of those stamp sets that I was talking about. The bundle won't be available in the discounted price because again, the bundle's only available the first time around. But the stamp set will be available and carry over and cling as will the framelits. So right now you can get it in wood or clear mount um, cling is very similar to clear mount, only the, the stickers are super sticky, and those will be available in cling once the new book is, comes out. So it's not really retiring, it's being reformulated. So whenever we go through and we um, have the word cling, you know that, that that's going to carry over. So this one's going to carry over in the new material, which is just like clear mount, it's just stickier. And this one too. So page 19. So we're flipping over to 20 now. So again, the bundle is retiring, but we this stamp set made it, and so did the framelits. This one's straight out retired, it's going away. I'm so sad about that one. This was the one that we used for the breast cancer fundraiser this year, and boy, it makes a lot of different cards. Like celebrate another wonderful year, could be New Year's or birthday. Um, we used it with the, these with the silver and gold rimmed cards. I really loved this set. It's like one of those all occasion staple sets. Um, okay, so this one, oh, the wine glass is retiring at two, at two. Hopefully we get another wine glass. This was uh, Linda Bowen's stamp set when she reached a million dollars in sales. Um, they let you design a stamp set. I'm almost halfway there, like maybe next month I'll, I'll hit half a million. Um, and then this one's going to carry over in cling. So when you're marking your catalog, you know that it's a carryover. Um, and then this one is going out, retiring. So page 24, retiring, climbing orchard, and sitting pretty or gone. Page 27, this is carrying over in cling. This is so much easier than reading it off the paper. I can't even tell you. Isn't it? it goes a lot faster. Um, so page 28, we've got bike ride and letterboard messages. They are both going out. I'm trying to get your comments back. Um, page 30, both of these stamp sets are going out. Again, Angie's set, my friend Angie Judah. Um, these are both retiring. And vertical greetings. I love this set because it's like because of the the way of the the size of it. Hi, Janice. Thank you. All right. So next page, page thirty-two. It'll carry over and cling, as will this little piggy, which I think is adorable. It's one of my favorite sets. 
Um, and the hot air balloons are going out, so lift me up. And hedgehogs are going out. Um, treat time is going out. And of course the, the bundle's gone too. This really bummed me out. We had this and then it went on back order and you couldn't get the punch. The, it was like the day that I finished the class that you could, like everybody in the class was able to buy it and then it went on back order and it's finally back in stock and it's retiring. I'm so bummed. This was my favorite punch of the season. Um, we made bouncing bunnies in that class. Doris was there. <laughs> Um, one for all is retiring and good times roll page 39 this is a really one of my favorite sets I wonder if I have my baggie book for that detailed with love let me see I'm gonna look in one second nope I guess it's not up there I, I have baggie books for all of the, the events that I do and with the catalog release party, I, I, this was the first set that I picked to play with. This one stamps so beautifully. It's like reverse, so the, the smiles doesn't is the part that doesn't have ink on it. It's so pretty. Um, around the corner made it. The pop on by sweet did not, so this whole page is gone. Okay, so page 42 and 43, all three of these sets you want to mark as retired. Let me know if I'm going too fast or if you're all right still. Page 44 is safe and 45 is safe. Page 46, top of the page, Itty Bitty Greetings is coming back in cling. So it's carrying over in a different material. You, you can still buy it in wood or clear. It'll be available in cling as soon as the clear runs out. And then in every season's retiring, pop of petals is coming back in cling. And the punch is too, but again, the, um, the bundle is retiring. So you won't be able to get the discount by bundling. You're the best typewriter. I love this. Um, this one's retiring. It's too bad. Tabs for everything, postcard pals, all of these are gone. Pocket Full of Sunshine is retiring, but the framelits that go with it are staying, and there's a new stamp set that I saw in the new book. So um, it's a cute, cute set. Um, I love it. So I'm glad that we get to continue to get the, the framelits anyway so we can make pockets. But Jar of Love is completely going out. So no more Jar of Love, no more Jar of Love framelits. And this sweet and root is, is all done. Okay, so we're on page 54. I'm gonna sit back down. <sighs> Friendly Expressions is going out. And um, the Follow Your Dreams bundle is going out. And so is One Wild Ride. This I'm really bummed about. My friend Dawn designed this one, Dawn Griffith. Um, yeah, and per for personal reasons, it was one of my favorites. Um, reminded me of my best friend Dawn. So. Um, At Home With You, page 56, is retiring. As well as Thoughtful Banners and Bubble Over, all three of these are gone. Bottom of page 58 and page 59, both of these are coming back in cling. So they will be available in cling. And page 60 and 61 are retiring. I hope that we have another coffee set at two. I love the coffee cup. I, I don't know that this will end up in the, in the, um, the dies for this. I don't think that I can part with those for the BOGO. It's awful, I'm such a hoarder. <laughs> um, okay, so Hanging Garden and, uh, no, Hanging Garden is retiring, and then these two sets are coming back in cling, so Hold On to Hope and Barn Door will be available again in cling. Both of these sets are retiring, page 64 and 65. You guys are awful quiet. 
Tell me you're going to switch to wine soon. <laughs> I'm having a sip of tea. Here we go. So skipping over 67, we'll go right on to, ooh, did I miss a page? I thought that Broadway birthday went out. I got to look. I got to bring the slip in. Let's see, page 69. No, okay, so that stayed. I don't know why I thought that went out. I, I really like this set, so that's pretty cool. Page 70, um, the retro or free cake stamp set is going out, retiring, but both of these sets made it and they're gonna carry over in the new material cling. Page 70 and 70, I'm sorry, page 72 and 73, all retiring, one, two, three. Page 74 and 75, all retiring this one I love you can make a card in 30 seconds with this because it you stamp it and the, the stamp the ink does all the work in the set I love it see like this one I could do without I I did buy it and I played with it and I didn't love it but um 76 and 77 are all retiring one two three I did like this one I like the font in the birthday Okay, and then 78 and 79, one, two, three, they're all retiring. Eighty-three is coming back as a cling mount. Page eighty-four and eighty-five. All three of these sets are retiring. I'm bummed about this one. I made some swaps for um Thailand with this one. I did little elephant um Post-it note holders. Mr. Fox and the Treehouse Adventure, both page, page 86 and 87, all of it's retiring. Page 88 and 89. This one you're going to see me make a card for. My nephew is making his confirmation, so I am probably going to put ink on that this week. And again, that religious set, I don't know if I can part with it because I don't get them often enough. And look at the font, it's just so beautiful. So I'll probably keep this one. Um, Sweet Baby is retiring. Page 90, retiring, retiring. And um, page 91 is coming back in cling. Going on to the holiday section. I know, Baby Bear is so cool. I had trouble lining them up um, my downline, Elaine McNamara, said, you have to line up the armpit and then the rest of it goes. And I was like, the armpit of a teddy bear. But it does work, so whatever whatever it takes. Um, mistletoe season is retiring, page 95. 96 and 97 is going. Hmm. I'm just going to take a moment of silence now. <sighs> At two cookie cutter. I, I I will miss him. I use this punch every which way you could imagine. So I suppose it's time to move on. Big sigh. Um, anyway, Star of Light, Night of Bethlehem, Nitra Sings, all retiring. Same with 100 and 101. Snowflake Sentiments, Hearts Come Home, Stylish Christmas, all retiring. Wow. Page 102 and 103, all retiring. Ready for Christmas, labels to love, and seasonal chums. Another one of those sets that I really liked. You could, you know, have um, the snowman bum on the back side of the card. So cute. And then the bunny. Oh, you just want to put like a little poof ball on the. Uh, there's something about bunny bums and poof. Makes me happy. Love and support. Beautiful promenade is safe. This one made it, and so did the pink gems. Um, the paper's going. Um, page 108. <clears throat> Best birds at the top is retiring. Um, at On the bottom, it's going to come back as a cling mount set. And then... Um, 
Page 109, Floral Phrases is retiring. Page 110, I'm so grateful this one's coming back as Kling. I love the distinctive stamps and the and the whole style of stamping. It, they, they stamp so beautifully. And if you don't know the um, ink pad trick, make sure you ask me because there's a trick to um, getting a little bit less ink on the pad so that you get all the detail in those flowers. Just ask me if you don't know the trick. Um, beautiful bouquet is staying. Wait a minute. Yeah, it's photopolymer. I was like, wait a minute, didn't it, it didn't say cling. Um, page 112 is retiring. Page 113, um, the Love You to Pieces is coming back as cling mount, so it's going to make the new book. Again, the bundle price will go away. Page 114 is completely retiring. Um, and page 115 is going to stay and come back as a cling mount set. Page 116 and 17 is completely going away. I'm going to miss this one. Um, I used to like to make cards with my, for my team with this because uh, you can do hard things. Wishing you success and only the best. They're just the cutest um, phrases, so I hope that we have um, things that come back. Sunny days ahead. I love that. Page 118 is coming back as Kling, one of my favorite sets in the book. Petal Palette is retiring, page 119. Kling Mount stamp set, Tropical Chic. This is coming back as Kling Mount. This paper is retiring, but the stamp set and the framelits will be available separately. The 10% is going away. And We can skip over to 124, Thankful Thoughts and All Things Thanks are going away. Be Thankful is coming back as a cling mount. It's adorable. We're doing good. Let's see. Okay, so um, on page 130, this one is coming back as a cling mount stamp set. And 131 is retiring, so the celebration calls for a celebration stamp set. Top of 132, you're inspiring, is retiring. And beautiful you will be back as a cling mount. This is great uh, for graduations. You can put a square on her head and um, she's, you know, a, a little tassel and you're good to go for a graduation card. Um, page 133 cling is coming back as a cling mount. So these will be available um, separately, not as a bundle. Beautiful Day is coming back as cling. Artistically Asian is retiring and Floral Frames is retiring. That's page 135. So then we can skip over to 138. Dragonfly Dreams and Eastern Beauty are both retiring. Painted Harvest is safe, yay. I like that set. Sheltering Tree is retiring. I do love this set. Um, it's okay, but I suppose they have to make room for things. <laughs> um, page 141 is both retiring playful backgrounds and fabulous flamingo. If they never retired anything, we'd still be um, scrapping with grandma's shag rug color, so it's okay. Uh, Rooted in Nature is coming back as a cling mount, but it won't be available as a bundle. This is another one that's kind of expensive separately, but I really see the value in um, bundling this one because it's more expensive. They're so pretty. Okay. 146 and 7. Everything on these two pages is retiring. The Mediterranean Moments, Tuscan Vineyard, and Country Living. 
Boohoo, page 148, another moment of silence for Lovely is a Tree. Um, what can I say? I love that. Uh, waterfront is staying. Both of the sets on page 150 and 151, all three, are retiring. So uh, Floral Statements, Southern Serenade, and All Good Things are all retiring. So you want to mark those. 152 is coming back as a cling mount. I was away. Um, we went to on stage and halfway down, we pulled over and I found a plastic wine glass. And it says, of course, I drink like a fish. I'm a mermaid. I thought that would be funny to go with the mermaid set. Um, page 153, the top set, Touches of Texture, is retiring. I'm going to miss this set. I loved it. Um, and then the bottom one is being reformulated with the cling mount. This is also distinctive, so the same trick with moving your um, the ink out of the way applies with these. Sea of Textures is coming back as cling. Page 156 and 157, all three sets, you want to mark those as retiring. Same thing with 158 and 159, they're all retiring. Took a little sip of tea there. Give you a chance to catch up if I was going too fast. Page 160, the sweet storybook is retiring. You know, I gotta be honest, I didn't even see this in the book until I was marking my book for retirement. Like, there's framelits, it's adorable. You know how I feel about mushrooms if you stamp with me in person. It's not really my thing, but it's adorable. Like, it reminds me of Bambi somehow. Anyway, um, Colorful Seasons is staying. Page 162 and 3. So the top of page 162, Woodwards, is retiring. And then the bottom two sets are both coming back in the cling mount. So Gallery Grunge and Country Road will both be back. Page 165, Painted Glass Cling Mount stamp set will be coming back. But this paper is going out. It's one of my faves to use with uh, blends. Page 166, Serene Garden, and 167, Bouquet Blooms are both retiring. Everything on 168 and 169 are retiring. I like that. They did the um, no-line watercolor. I always find great ideas in the book. And funny, like again, I, I don't ever remember seeing that idea before. Um, page 170 and 171, both of these are retiring. Okay, you ready for this? Handwritten is coming back in cling, and all of these are going out. I really love the sheet music one. That's got to be my favorite. Well, I like hardwood too. It's so hard to decide, but I'm kind of bummed about these. Um, Pick a Pennant is going out, retiring. Everything on page 175 is going out, all three. And the alphabet dies that go with this are going too, which I'm kind of sad about. They were my favorite um, dies. So we can skip over this page and go to 179. And Crafting Forever is coming back as cling. Right now it's wood or clear. Okay, we're coming into accessories. Bear with me. Everything that has an in color in it from 2017 to 2019 is going out. If you do not have your re-inkers to protect the investment for the ink pads and you want them, you should order those today. I'm not even kidding. I have a hostess code open, X3PG7VX6, or let's see, it's right here. I'll give you a second. If you need to, you can pause the video or whatever. But um, seriously, if you don't have the reinkers, I can tell you every single year I have people that come to me in like the end of May and they're like, I need a fresh pig reinker. And I'm like, I'm sorry, it's sold out. So please 
you know, protect your investment if you've already bought those pads. Make sure that you have refills. Um, basically, everything is retiring for those in colors. In addition, we had a, a new color shakeup at the beginning of last year, and all of the new color assortments are going out. So the new color assortment in the ink pads, the markers, and the cardstock. This filled in your collection if you had, you know, all the colors but those. Okay, and then we'll skip over these pages for a minute. So, I'm gonna make it really simple. Every designer series paper, gone. On all the pages. They will come out with new papers and I've seen some of them and they're gorgeous. Actually, I have some in my living room but I can't show them yet because I have to kind of get my head around it. Page 192. Colored doilies retired, striped treat bags retired. Then the bottom of the page, glossy white cardstock is not coming back. You're gonna see um, my glossy paper technique classes that are coming through um, on Tuesday morning. That's the day that I usually do my lives. This week I did my live, and if you were looking to get the packet from me, that was the host code from this week's live. Um, I'm going to continue to do glossy paper techniques and every week I'll have a different technique card and sample. If you place an order of $15 or more during that week, I'll send you the make and takes. Um, you would just have to have, the, in this case, the brush o and the white Elmer's glue to com and the stamp set to complete your um, cards. All right, so white glossy card stock's going out at two. Watercolor paper is going, but they have a replacement, and um, after talking to Diane, my assistant, she was telling me all about watercolor paper and how awesome it is. So um, they're coming out with a good one, so don't get nervous about that. The gable boxes are going on page 193. Um, the narrow note cards and envelopes, and this one I'm kind of sad about, the delightfully detailed note cards and envelopes. These are so easy to work with, and the front of them are already watercolored, so you could just stamp a sentiment on it, stuff it in the card, write out what you need to write out, and you have a card in a couple of seconds. So I'm bummed about that. They were a good addition to our product line for um, newbies. Whew. On to page 194 and 5. Um, so the top row is staying. Bottom row, the basic black 6x8 is staying, but all of these are going. There's a replacement for the leather album, and um, the memories and more cards are going. The um, tea room memory pack, delightfully detailed, those are going out. We'll have replacements for those. Same with uh, the ones on 196. Page 197, faceted dots are going. Best root enamel shapes. Share what you love pearls. Twinkle adhesive backed sequins. Sorry if I'm going too fast. I'll, you can always just pause me if I'm rambling. Uh, page 198. Share what you love embellishment kit. Those of you that took my retreat in a box, they mailed out today and you got one of those as a special gift from me. Um, tea Room Copper Vinyl Stickers, the Brads are going, both the Basic and the Metallic, um, Blossom Elements, the Metallics in the Sequin Assortment are retiring, and the um, Tranquil Textures Sprinkles are going out. Let's make page 199 easy, everything's gone. Page 200, I'll give you a second to catch up. That'll give me a second to take a sip. So the top three are gone. The cord, the shimmer ribbon, and the double stitch ribbon in all colors. Um, for the mini striped ribbon, the poppy parade is going out, but the other two are staying. And then um, these two are going. This was a mistake. For this one, the Very Vanilla is going. 
and the gold and copper thread are going, but the rose and the silver are staying. Um, bottom row, the eighth inch solid ribbon and the half inch lace trim are retiring. Hopefully I still have you with me. Whoop, whoop. It's time for a joke or a stretch or something, but we're almost there. Um, top of page 201, mini ruffled ribbon. Berry burst, metallic edge ribbon, but the other two are staying. All of these are going, the silver baker's twine. The only thing in this row that's staying is the whisper white baker's twine. Everything else is gone. Velvet ribbon's gone. Gingham ribbon's gone. The black satin ribbon stayed. And both um, of these combo packs are gone. Brusho Crystal Color is going. Again, something that I was, I've was i been playing with um, this week. Kind of crazy. Um, but there there is something in the new book called Sprinkles. I don't know if it's the same thing, but I'll have to play with it to let you know. Um, the In Color Embossing Powder is retiring, as well as the Silver Embossing Paste. On Ink Spectrum Pads going. Page 203. There's no updates, love that. And we can skip right over the blends, they're all staying. This is fine. Um, there's The piercing tool is going, but we have that in that little um, $10 doohickey anyway, so it's silly to have a paper piercer tool when we've got the other thing that does 100 things. That's like one thing for 10 bucks. Um, the Stampin' Trimmer. I got nothing. I told you guys about this a couple of weeks ago. We've had horrible times with the manufacturer trying to get replacement blades. I'm really sorry about that. Um, there were some people that didn't love this trimmer and we are in the process of reformulating one and I have no doubt that what Stampin' Up! picks out for us is gonna be awesome. So this I'm sad about. Everybody needs a gift bag punch board and an envelope punch board. Um, you can make gift bags in different sizes. You can make your own envelopes. I can't believe we're getting rid of those, but I love them. Here we go. Handheld circle, one eighth of an inch is retiring. And then uh, with the punches on the circles, it's kind of weird. There's, there's three of them. One and three quarters, one and one quarter, and a three-quarter circle are retiring and the rest stay. The duet banner is going and the blossom builder is going, but the rest is staying. Um, again, I'm bummed about the bunny. Bunny bums and fluffy tails. Seriously, I need that punch still. Um, I haven't had it enough time with it, but because I see like if you cut his ears off, there's like a little frog in there. There's, like Even this guy looks like a frog to me. I'm so sad. Cookie cutter we've had for a long time, I can't complain. Lemon builders going out, fox builders going out. Okay, here we go. Page 214. Again, I got nothing. Big shots going. Cutting pads already sold out. Um, but we're still going to have a die cutting system. We're going to have it proprietary to Stampin' Up. More details are coming. It's not ready and they don't want to give us an inferior product and I don't blame them. So I am 100% standing behind them on this. We're going to have some beautiful framelits and beautiful embossing folders coming out in the new catalog that you can use in whatever die cutting system that you happen to have. So it'll be all right. So with that, page 215, Apron Builder Framelits, At Home Framelits, Bethlehem Edge Lits, and Birds and Blooms Finlets are all going out. Hope you're still with me. Page 216, we've got the top of the page, bottles and bubbles, bouncing baby framelits, 
Build a Bike is going. Not going to miss that one. Um, everything at the bottom of this page, all the, the rest of the six, you can put in R, retiring. So the coffee cups. I really, I'm going to miss them. Page 217. I must have been getting tired because I did a D, but I'm guessing that's an R. Um, detailed Dragonfly is going. Everything in the second row. And everything at the bottom except for Flourish Thinlet. So don't mark these three and mark everything else. All right, moving on. Page 218, large letter framelits at two. At the bottom of the page, it's the four at the bottom here. Little Loves, Mayflowers, Orchid Builder, Petals and More. Top of the page, the top half, the only one that you're not going to mark is the pocket framelits. Like I said, there's going to be a, a new set coming out for that. Um, and at the bottom of the page, you're only going to mark the seasonal tags and the spot of tea. Everything else is staying, which is nice. I love that um, butterfly. Starlight thinlets are going out. Come down to the middle again, storybook scene, sunshine wishes, swirly scribbles at the bottom, the two on the outside, swirly snowflakes and thrill ride. Top of page 221, up, up and away, window box thinlets, wood crate framelits, and basically Everything else on this page, I don't know why I didn't mark those big shots going, so all that's going too. Whoop, almost. Ha ha. All right, so on this page, we're going to keep the basket weave and the layered leaves, and everything else is retiring. So there's seven in there that you're going to mark. On this page, Petal Burst and Quilt Top are retiring. These two are staying. Pinewood Plains is staying. Scattered Sequins is going. And then both of these are retiring. I'm going to miss the polka dots. It was one of my go-tos. Third row, um, you keep the seasonal wreath and all the other three are going. So Softly Falling, Sparkle, and Simple Stripes. Striped Scallops is going, and the rest of that is staying in the next catalog. So I'll give you a second. Okay, and then we go to the Hostess sets, and you know that every time we um, have a new catalog, that the Hostess sets retire. Woo! So all of these are going. So you can mark. You can just keep marking your book. Um, all the hostess sets are going to be gone. Hang on a second. I'm gonna move the camera. That was a lot. <laughs> so how are you guys doing? Do you have any questions for me? I'm going to give you a second because I, I think there's a lag in the time so I can talk here and then I'm looking at myself still flipping the camera over there. Phew, that was a lot. I missed adhesive sheets. Sorry, thank you. What page? Let's go, to, let's go back to the adhesive stuff. Maybe I skipped the page. Could very well be. That was a lot. Adhesives is on 213. Let's do it together. Yep, and, it, and it's lucky. There's only one thing on that page, the adhesive sheets. Thank you. You know, it's so much better to sit and go through it that way. Um, it's funny, Betty, I've never used the adhesive sheets. Thank you, Chrissy. 
Thanks, guys. I I am so, yeah, I am going to um, leave this up on my page, and then I'm going to download it, and I'm going to post it to YouTube as well. So um, it'll be here on my business page um, forever. I'm not going to um, get rid of it. So, yay. <sighs> I think it's time to switch from tea to something else. It sounds like a good plan. Yes, they have a whole bunch of photopolymer um, in the new catalog. Um, they have uh, distinctive sets in both photopolymer and the new cling mount. And the cling mount is basically just like the clear mount, um, except the stickers actually stick. Um, I actually found them, a couple of downline found them to be so sticky that they won't use the stickers at all because they pull their stamp apart trying to get it off the block. So what I do is um, I take the distinctive stamp once I've got the sticker on it and I'll put it on my clothes, I'll put it on like my face, on my arm, just anything to get stuff on the back of it um, so that it will be less sticky because it is that sticky. And yeah, hang on, let me grab a distinctive stamp and I'll show you the trick. Hang on a minute. I just, I'll need a second because this is off the cuff, so hold on. So I found an ink pad. We'll go with blueberry bushel. And uh, of course, like it would be nice if they marked the distinctive stamp. I know the one in my head that I want. Somebody shout out a distinctive stamp set name for me. I want the one with the rose on it. Oh. Off the cuff is only good if you like close to stuff, like I can't even, where is, maybe I should have you guys help me look, because that's just sad, let me see, all right, well, I can't find a distinctive stamp, but you know what I do have? I have samples that I did before with them, so I'm going to show you one of those and then show you the trick. So I have a downline who messaged me um, with the Lily set, um, and this is retired. It, it was celebration, but all the distinctive stamp sets work the same way. Hey, Song Sook! Ah, I got Song Sook on a live video. That's, that's so cool. Song Sook has been on my team for a very long time, and I... Anyway... Um, this stamp was originally stamped with the um, the distinctive stamps with a regular ink pad and it looked like poop. Like poop on Whisper White. So, we're going to take the ink pad and open it. And then you're going to take it and really work this ink. So I'm taking a bone folder and I'm really working the ink off to the side. Then once I ink up my stamp, I'm gonna ink it up from the middle, and you can't really see, I really did move the ink, I worked it. I didn't just like, I wasn't wimpy about it, I wanna take the ink and really get it out to the edges. So now all the ink is on the edge of my pad, and the middle has less, and now when I ink and stamp with the distinctive stamps, that's when you get that pretty, um, clean, beautiful, very detailed, less ink. Um, oh my gosh, well, I'm sorry that you're not feeling well, but I'm grateful that you're here because I love to see you. So. Um, but that's how you do the distinctive stamp thing. You just pull the ink out of the way. Now, I've heard people say that you can use a sponge dauber to ink them and that that works really good too, but that involves like getting a sponge dauber dirty and they're, you know, a dollar a piece, so. That's an easy way to always have a way to use your distinctive stamps and not have them be gross. Yeah. So, yay. Glad I could answer that, Kelly. And sorry I couldn't find the actual stamp. But anybody else have anything for me? <sighs> yeah, this is when I really liked the soft sayings. Um, and it's going completely out. And I like having um, books that I can 
just show off the cuff like this because it makes life easier. And I gotta say this, like the sparkle on the paper with the, and it's already pre-cut, there's nothing to do but stick down, you know? It's like cheating. But nobody knows it's cheating if you're the crafter. <laughs> oh, the baggie book? Um, I took, you know the, the six by eight Stampin' Up! cello bags? They're in the back of the book. Um, I just take a six by eight bag and um, put the cards back to back like that. And then I make a topper and the topper is just four by six and you can fold it in half and put a label on it. Or if you're anal like me, you can figure out how to run it through the printer. It's not that hard. Like I set it up in word and I print two on a paper and I cut um, down the sides and then I make sure that this ends up being four by six and I score it in half at two. So on both sides. And then the most important part of this is you can um, staple these shut, but then they're not expandable. So when I make them for a quarterly, for example, hang on, I'll get another one. This is a perfect example. I did this one for um, my needle and thread card class. When, I, when we have a new catalog, I do four complete classes. And if you take the class, you can put them in a baggie book like this, and then when you make another card with this example, you can put them on the table and everybody can ooh and out. Ah, or you can use it so that you can go back afterwards and remember what you did and make more. Um, anyway, this one doesn't have any cards in the back, so it's expandable because I used a brad. If I stapled it shut, I'm kind of stuck with it, but using a brad is key because then it's expandable and then you can put more bags. So yeah, super cool. So, well, I'm grateful that you guys were all in with me. Um, I should make this a thing every time a catalog goes out because I do it anyway. In the morning, I have a class in Litchfield and there's eight ladies coming. Um, and I'm gonna be marking catalogs for all of them tonight so that when they look at the book, that they're gonna know which ones are coming back and cling and which ones are completely retiring so that they can you know make their choices easier tomorrow so but I think oh it's funny Betty this shirt Alexis cleaned her room today I have to thank my customer Julie because last night she's like I don't know how you live like that ba, 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 ba. and without a word for me today Alexis cleaned her room so she had a whole bunch of clothes in her room that she's never gonna wear again, and I have shrunk. So I have a whole new wardrobe thanks to my daughter. They're all sitting on my bed. I have to go through. I have to go through and try them on. Um, so this is one of, the, of Alexis's shirts. So I like her her taste. So that's good. All right, guys. It's been really fun to hang out with you tonight, have a little bit of tea or whatever it is you happen to be drinking, and um, mark our catalogs up together. Hi, Linda. Um, and if you did miss it, you can always catch it on the hashtag replay um, and check out and go through your catalogs to make it easier for you. So we'll see you guys later. Oh, and if you wanted to, um, I suppose that I'm backwards now. Um, if you wanted the host code for this week, it's X3PG7VX6. Boy, that's easy. Toodles. We'll see you guys later. <laughs> Have a great night.